Hello, hey, how we doing? Jennifer Moffitt coming to you here from Asheboro, North Carolina. I am a certified health coach and I love to help people rock their wellness. So I wanted to share some um, tips on carbs today. Carbs are always a big topic. I know it started back in, gosh, years ago, probably in the 90s, I would think, with the Atkins diet. Could be wrong about the date for that, but nonetheless, you get what I'm trying to say. They said, cut out the carbs. Even the complex carbs? No way. Not gonna do it. Complex carbs are great for us. Um, they make us full longer, and they're full of fiber, they're full of antioxidants, minerals, nutrients that we need, because food is fuel, okay? You, you don't just get vitamins and nutrients from a vitamin. It actually comes from food. Okay, so I'll start with the first complex carb on uh, my list. Oatmeal, a great superfood. Awesome for winter time. I just had some this morning. I like to make an overnight oats recipe. If you want that, let me know. I'll be happy to get that to you. It's super simple. Doesn't take long to prep at all. And then you just grab it out of the fridge and go. Okay, quinoa. Quinoa is a great alternative. Um, you have a lot of um, minerals in there. And it's a good um, alternative to having rice. Okay, because a lot of people like rice, which is fine, but quinoa is a great alterna al alternative, okay? Air popped popcorn, I have a great story behind this. My grandpa used to make popcorn on the stove and loved it, loved it. And then, of course, microwave popcorn came out, loaded with sodium, still okay, not trying to diss on Air popped popcorn by no means, but I prefer to pop mine on the stove if, if I have the time. And I like to do it with olive oil, or I like to dress it with olive oil, and I like to actually pop it with coconut oil. It's all about the fats, folks. You gotta marry your carbs, your proteins, your fruits, your vegetables. You gotta marry all of it to create that really good food synergy. Okay. So whole grain pasta, this is really gonna keep you um, energized. It's a good healthy alternative if you're gonna do pastas. Raspberries and blueberries are such a good antioxidant superfood. Um, really good for your heart um, as well. The raspberries provide that tartness. I actually had raspberries with my oatmeal or even yogurt. Such a good, um, uh, such a good thing to marry with um, a, a breakfast item or even like put it in a shake all right so we have kiwi kiwi you can grab at most grocers nowadays prepped for you so even if you don't go buy a kiwi at your local farmers market or even a grocery store you can get it um, prepped for you they slice it for you um, kiwi is really good in water as a like a fruit infused water so good with that love it lots of vitamin C okay pomegranates I think we're on the end of pomegranate season actually we might be over um, pomegranates are really fun fact they really do reduce the risk of prostate cancer later in life um, so you know give your guy a pomegranate all right so we've got beans I had beans last night in my turkey chili that I made in the crock pot, super simple. I had some sweet potatoes, diced those up, threw them in with turkey chili or turkey uh, ground turkey, black beans, so good. So good for us, good protein. If you are vegetarian, great source to, to check out for your protein. And um, last but not least, sweet potatoes. I also had that in my turkey chili. That was a yummy added treat. Um, sweet potatoes are actually, there's so many benefits to sweet potatoes, y'all. So many. Lots of um, fiber. It's actually really good for diabetics, I was reading, which I did not know. I guess it helps stabilize that blood sugar. Really good for us. Good heart healthy. Um, so these are all good complex carbs. So versus going to the simple carb, which is, we all know, which is more junk food type items. So that's 
Lance crackers, like anything in the vending machine, pretty much. I wish the vending machines would have fruits and vegetables, or f at least fruits. I know vegetables would be tough, but don't you wish we had that? I do. All right. Well, I hope this was helpful to you. Please uh, follow me if you haven't already. Click subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll be sharing more in the future. And I really appreciate the love and support out there. Happy Wellness Wednesday.